Hi, this is Darren Shepard from Rancher Labs, and today I'd like to introduce Kubernetes environments in Rancher. In Rancher, we allow you to group resources together into what we call environments. They can have multiple environments, uh, such as load, prod, test. Uh, you can very easily turn one of these environments into a Kubernetes environment by just going to the properties of the environment and then selecting Kubernetes as your container orchestrator. Once you've selected Kubernetes, we immediately start to go and deploy the Kubernetes management stack. So you can see right now we're actually deploying etcd, the API server, controller master, scheduler. If you want, you can even look and kind of see what's going on underneath the hood here. You can see these are all the various services that we're deploying right now to get Kubernetes up and running. After a couple minutes, the Kubernetes stack will be deployed and you can immediately start using Kubernetes. Through the web UI, we give you easy access to kube control. So you can immediately start typing uh, all the commands you're familiar with, like git pods, you can see here git, git nodes, uh, that all the nodes are already registered in this environment. Additionally, if you want, you can generate the config here that you can use to download it so you can run kube control from your desktop. Notice that we add our own authentication on top of it. You can deploy services in Kubernetes using all the ways that you're already familiar with, such as kube control. Additionally, we allow you through our UI to go and add services, replication controllers, or pods just by pasting the text. Additionally, you can deploy applications through the catalog. The catalog provides a simple means to package up complex applications so you can deploy them with a single click. Optionally, you can put in some questions so that people can fill this in. For example, how many front-end replicas do I want? Once the user goes and clicks launch, you'll see that we will immediately start deploying the application. So you can see the front end, these services have come up. Uh, additionally, I have some replication controllers and the various pods. You can see they're all up and ready. Additionally, in Rancher, we implement the load balancer service. So you can see this front end here is of type load balancer. If I go to the system tab, you can see my Kubernetes load balancers here. And so that load balancer that I set up is available right here. And you can see the guestbook application running. That concludes my introduction to Kubernetes environments in Rancher. Thanks.